What is going on, Internet? Zyjix here, coming at you with another Mega Man Battle Network 3 video. Last time we got a clue. Come to the place of battle where we can find someone else who can give us another clue to make our way toward S. I'm willing to bet it's Serenade and, um, oh, well, save. I sense Tintage Warrior's power. You are rank three, Navi. Graham, looks like you come from my rank two. It's strange. You look too innocent for under net. You can for a Navi called S. S? What a little, what would a young punk like you want with S? Know him? I might. But if you were rank three, you should know him yourself. You should know how you how to get what you want in the undernet. Am I battling? No, you got it. Power can get you anything. If you can beat me, I will tell you all all about S. And if you can't, deletion will be your only comfort. Ah, uh, missed man apparently. Okay. None of the battling. Let me guess, I gotta hit the lamp. Uh oh. Oh crap. Aren't you just a prick? Yep, it's all call it. You gotta hit the lamp. Well, good setup here. Now that restricts his movement from one. Crap is quick. Well, I don't think I can get rid of those. But I can sure as heck hit this. I don't, no, those don't... Ah, crap, no, that's not what I wanted to do. Move. There we go. wonder if that actually did more damage to him. Getting them. How to heal. Okay, so the mist doesn't actually hurt me. But yes it does. This doesn't hurt me that much. Hmm. This is gonna be a tough one. Oh. Hey, he's he's tougher, right? Body takes no damage, but um. Oh, well, he's gonna have to move through it. Yeah, body takes no damage, but the lamp is where it's where all the damage is taken. The question is, does he float or does he actually use the panels? He uses panels. Obviously. Nope, but he can teleport around. Well, he's only got one left. He's not going anywhere. This will do wonders. Actually, get to him! There we go! Well. Alright, I beat him. You must be incredibly powerful to defeat me. Last time I lost was ten years ago, to Serenade. Serenade, you mean... It is, whoops. Oh. Alright, Serenade, you mean... It is he, the one you refer to as S, that you seek. Really? Tell me where I can find him. I will tell you where Serenade is, deep within the Undernet Square, or Undersquare, in the area where regular navvies cannot enter. So, how do I get to that area? Take this, and make haste to Undernet Server. Rank 2. The Undernet Server? The server room that runs the Undernet lies somewhere in the real world. From there, the way shall open up to you. The door to the server room is hidden by a boulder. Server room hidden by a boulder. Where could it be? We'll just have to search everywhere. For me? You think he's strong enough? Uh, no, we're not battling him again. All right, so where? Where's this boulder at? All right, here we are. Um, where's this boulder? Um, this will be the only thing that makes sense. I didn't realize I could jack in here. There's a whole computer here, holy crap. Fire plus 30, okay, good deal. Ah! That's how I'd get in. 
keep backing up there because I don't need to screw around with that. I never knew you could get in there. Let's go. Oh, that's how you get out. Well, that's gotta be it. You can see an elevator inside the boulder. Wanna get in? This sounds evil. So this is the Undernet server. I, I bet you the, the the in manager is totally in on it. This server's huge. It's never it's never I've never seen anything like it. Air of rank two, Jack in. Who said that? Jack in. Well, we didn't come all this way for nothing. Ready? Be willing. Jack in. Here we go. Ah, so that's how we get behind there. And I'm going in. What's this? Where does this giant hole lead? You have done well to make it this far. My name is Serenade. Rain all over the rank navvies. Serenade, I'm a good man. Come on behalf of the officials to get to the Forbidden Program. Someone is trying to awake Alpha. Fortunately, the pro Forbidden Program cannot be given. Only a chosen one may wield the program. Chosen one? If I don't, that society will perish. Are you prepared to take on the test to see if you are the chosen? If so, reach out and take out the program in front of you. Dave. It is the one which you seek. It is the forbidden program. Alright, get him, Eggman. This is the forbidden program. Now then, take it. If it flare if if it flares up with blue flame, you are a chosen one. It and can, and, and can wield the program. However, if you are not chosen, you will immediately suffer the effect of the program. You, Mega Man, will be frozen for all eternity. No power will be ever, ever, ever be able to awaken you. Now then, grasp the program and discover your destiny. Man. Ah! Of course, this could glow, glow blue. Mega Man, so he is frozen. No. No! Hmm. Ah, uh, there we go. And I did it! I can use the program! What were you thinking pulling a stunt like that? Excellent. The program is now yours to wield, Mega Man. That Giga Freeze. Alright, Mega Man. Mission complete. Not yet. We have to we have to take this program to the officials. Alright, that's right. There is another Navi who can wield the Dr. Hikari's program. Dad? I knew it wouldn't take long. Uh, I knew it wouldn't take you long to reach there, Nade. Who's there? I'm the administrator of the Undernet. What? Are you kidding me? Mamoru is a friggin' admin for Undernet? Actually, the creator of the Undernet was a Scilab scientist. That scientist was my father. Wait, your father? Scilab scientist created the Undernet? So you mean it was it was a Scilab project? Never heard anything like that. The internet is a weapon to count. The internet is a weapon to counter Alpha, created to develop and preserve the Forbidden Program. But if Scilab is made by internet, wait. But if Scilab made the internet, why is it so dangerous? Now? Because the Forbidden Program is was too dangerous. It has the power to freeze Alpha, and, and which, if means of misuse, all the net society can be frozen in an instant. Is that much power? Yes. That's why they created it in a vast area away from the regular net. If it was an if it was if an accident were to occur, the damage would be contained since it would be since it would be isolated. It turned out it'd be perfect for hiding place for criminals. Tell me, Mamoru. So many measures have been had to be taken against Alpha. What exactly is he? Ultimate beast. The creation of Scilab, of course. Uh oh. Emergency alert! The Tetra Gate has been destroyed! No, it's Alpha! Quick, land, hurry to Scilab 1! Someone's stealing Alpha! Got it, Mega Man, let's get to Scilab 1! All at the same time as Scilab 1. Drill mode! Activate Tetra Codes! 
that what that is? I've been, I've been going by that about like a 500 times. Elfa is mine. Oh, okay. He's uh, he's breaking through. This is the end of Net Society. The intruder is stealing Alpha. Official scum. You're too late. Drill mode. <laughs> what the? What? What did he just do? Alpha's been stolen. That society is doomed. Okay. I kind of figured we, um, we'd come across that at some point, but... I'm gonna run to Scilab here. Alright, I'm gonna do a jump cut here to get to Scilab here. We gotta move quick. Alright, guys, we're here at Scilab. Um, holy crap, this video is getting long enough. I think I'm going to go ahead and stop here, guys. So if you guys liked this video, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe down below. Uh, I'll be seeing you guys in the next video. So thank you guys very much for watching. God bless you all. See you in the next one.